Today, this is the Crew 2's latest update, The Contractor. I've got early access again, thank you to Ubisoft and mate. Oh my god, we can get a four crown Victoria for one crew credit. Everything you see here will pass down to you so you can get all this stuff just like I can, but in your actual game. The update will be coming out tomorrow. This is one of the new cars in the update. It's a Ford Crown Victoria as a taxi. Now, this update is a little bit odd, to be honest with you. Not something I would expect from a racing game, but to be honest with you, I think it's pretty cool. As you can clearly see, uh, this. We can become a taxi driver. We receive a thousand for doing it. New things have been added to the map. You can use hypercar, street race. This is the first time that new activity has actually been placed around the map. Now, trust me, trust me. The cars in this update are just way, way crazy. So we're going to take the client to the destination. Basically, it's going to end up being a time trial. Let's get it. We can use any car we want, but of course, if we have the taxi, we got to use the damn taxi. It's a super odd update, I must say, especially for a game that kind of focuses on racing and stuff. But compared to the complete opposite of the previous, where they just kind of did like hardcore racing, I, ca I kind of dig it. I think the crew could become like this big mishmash of like GTA style stuff. But when games do things like this, it really makes me think, they're definitely trying stuff for a future game. And here we are. Oh, no, no, no. I missed the, <laughs> I missed the finish. Uh, sorry. Calm down. Sorry. Get out. And there you go. You get a thousand bucks. It's just a nice little simple objective. I, I wonder if there are actually any missions. Like, other than this, obviously. So here we are over on the activities. Jump in. And as you can see, we have got drivers wanted in New York, Miami, Detroit, Las Vegas, and Los Angeles. Now, you can already, you might have already just seen a little sneak peek of one of the coolest things of this update. Interesting. Interesting. There's no actual missions. So we do have the taxi version, but we also have the normal version of the Ford Crown Victoria added to this update. There's actually quite a few very odd cars that I'm very actually excited to look forward to build and play with. So I want to start with Ford Crown Victoria. Can we customize this car? If not, I'll be a little bit annoyed. Let's get on with it then. We've got visual parts here. We have HUD customization. Oh, what the... <laughs> Oh my god, okay. why did I ever I ever think that yeah yeah there won't be any updates? No 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 that's that's it. This is gonna be the sickest taxi you have ever seen. Oh my god, it kind of looks like a chaser, like a American chaser. I love that. I love the, the bars at the front, but we're going for that chaser look. I, I, I'm making it, I'm making it. So let's go for number 11. We got the front fenders. Oh my god, we can make it wide, boy. Very cool. We can change the wheels, which I'm definitely going to because they are oh Oh, you know what? Those are hot, boy. <laughs> Come on, you do not disappoint, okay? Oh, we can change the caliper color. Let's, uh, I don't know what color I'm going to make the car yet. Honestly, I really like the color that's on this. <gasps> Mate, why is that so sick? I, I don't know. I, why is it so sick? It's literally just like police lights on it. <laughs> Mate, I love it. I, w I was coming in like, oh, there might not be that much to it, but... We got a nice little boy there, and we got something stupid on the back there. That is disgusting, and I'm going for it. You fully know that I'm going for it. Let's see if we got anything chaser style again. Oh, yes. That looks pretty sick. It's got a big old butt. <laughs> I was going to say lip, but it's in the rim. Uh, and then we could go for... Should we go for, like, a yellow detail on the interior? Let's do that. We're going to keep the normal dash. Keep the seats, like, a slight... Oh, mate, that's disgusting. <laughs> I'm just going to put a yellow stripe and stick with material one. And we can actually put... Oh, mate, I was going to go for the carbon, but you, the wood, come on. That's right, I'm going grandpappy style. <laughs> what the flying hell have I created here? What is this thing? Yes, yes, we're going for the damn white walls. We've got the window tint that we can put on there. Come on, we're going to do it. And we've got horns, which we can customize as well. Now, colors, manufacture colors. Here we have <laughs> many pretty darn cool colors. You know, I actually picked this color for my, for my crown Vic that we built in need for speed. So do we need to go for something? We're going to go for white. We're going for that full chase. Up. Nah, nah, nah. Come on. We're, we're going to do some color. And of course, this is the Crew 2's early access. So we have full NOS parts on this thing. 700 horsepower. This looks horrible. Good horrible. So you, you don't understand. <laughs> Before we carry on and drive that thing and show you some of the other cars in this update, uh, let's have a look at the motor pass, shall we? Oh my god. <laughs> We're just going to buy the premium motor pass straight away on this early version. And we're going to look through some of the... Look at this car. There's some beautiful cars we just unlocked. But look, it's a bloody limousine. <laughs> what the hell? What are these wheels? Oh my God. This is just getting out of hand, I feel like. It's just a bit mental. This though, that's pretty sick. I want to put that on my car. And here it is in the free roam. <laughs> 
I was gonna say, that's me. I was really confused there for a second. This is mental, this thing. And of course, it's early access, so I can't bring it into PvP to try it out. But what I can do is show you the next car. We're gonna blitz through these cars. We're gonna switch to the limousine <laughs> version. What the hell is going on? Now, you already know we need to drift this thing. Clearly, it's just asking for it. In what world do we not get a limo in a racing game and go, yeah, 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 let's go for some skids. Oh my god, I can already tell this thing's gonna be mega. First though, uh, let's customize it. Oh. Ah, oh, come on. I was so, so hoping, but we can make it pink. <laughs> That's an official color. It's pink. It's already, it's already maxed out. Good, we need 700 horsepower. Another brand new car is this one, which we saw as well. Is there any customization for this limo? Look, if there ain't, I'm gonna be really upset. Damn it! <laughs> That's a big shame, big, big shame. So in that case, we're gonna jump into the pro setting straight away, and we're gonna make this thing just properly slide. So let's turn this off, and this off, and this off. Drift assist, that actually helps a little bit easier. We're gonna bring it down a little bit. Let's test this. Worst case, we'll just remove all the grip from the rear. Try to drift the bridge, baby! Oh, balls! Oh! <laughs> Don't get in my taxi. It's so weird to drive such a long vehicle. <laughs> just, uh, yeah, just just push it out into a full old skid straight away. Noss and handbrake to give you that sharp jolt. Look out! Awesome! You know, it would have been so cool to have customization for this thing. Like, even just the parts that are available for the other crown vehicle. Well, it's wobbling. <laughs> Can you tell I've removed all grip from the rear? Uh, you should be able to. <laughs> so now it's just a permanent slide machine. There's just no way for it to grip <laughs> whatsoever. <laughs> this ain't no drift car. I've ruined the damn thing. Let's add a little bit back. It, 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 it needs it. Now, of course, this is just the beginning of the update cars. Usually they add around 25 to 20, whatever, new cars. And so we've got maybe like eight at the moment. I just realized, can we go into first person view? Oh my God, we can. Just not even the- Oh! It just pulls forward. I've got no grip. This is definitely my favorite car of the update. I think it's fantastic. But of course, the fact they've added limos makes for some uh, interesting roleplay gameplay and stuff. Maybe maybe that's what they're going for. Oh! Let me know what you think of the update down below in the description. This is going to make you check out the game again. I thought I would give you a quick sum up. Of course, because I got early access, obviously. So, yeah. Thanks for watching. Smash the like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.